your veteran players. Well, you saw all these guys. Yeah, Soraya, I mean, he's been a terrific passer for them now for his uh, four-year career. Anthony Preciado is a very fiery player. He's going to be ranks in the middle, and uh, he's a strong guy as well. Um, Roberto Lopez, a little bit undersized as a setter, but super athletic and such an intelligent setter. All set. Tre oh, tremendous athlete. Um, and then, of course, you know, the stud in the middle, I'm sorry, in the middle of the team, that is. Uh, he's actually playing on the outside, is uh, Cesar Medina. But, uh, you know, talking to, to other people earlier, you know, it's not the Cesar Medina show. They have some true talent and balance. They, they lost their, their coach, Lee Lin Wong, who was the coach of the year for Division II last year. I'll be interested to see how that affects them. The one nice thing is they're seniors. They've been together for a long time, and they have committed to being champions. So, I mean, they're a tremendous talent, um, a tall order for us to try, uh, to try and surpass. We're hoping this year the result's going to be different, though. You may not say it's not just the Caesar Medina show, but most people say hail to Caesar because this guy gets it done. He is an incredible hitter. He's an, and it's true. It's not just him. He has a good unit behind him, and they had a good run in the regional. I think they'll have a better run in the regional if they make it this year. About Bravo, this is a team I don't know much about. This is a club that's new to the party. A lot of people are talking them up. They have a very solid team. Uh, Jimmy Lim, a, a junior middle blocker. He, he's one of the potential stars of this team. Justin Nyinko, a senior and a setter who gets the ball to all of his teammates. He's been solid in the past. And Simon Kawaji, a junior middle blocker who is also very, very solid. Uh, and I'll start Flores who is following in the steps of Kalani Hawaiian, which is probably going to be very tough for him to do. Kalani was very inspirational. He would make his team play all of a sudden and then be very focused. Bravo's going to be good. There can be one of those dark horse teams that can take that fourth seed, and you have to be careful for them.